Oh, God. This is probably the teacher. I, I'd say so, yeah. I do not remember his voice. You two are awfully loud today. Can you not grant... <laughs> That's it, Can you though. not grant the rest of us a little peace and quiet? Oh, fuck, it's not even him. <laughs> Is this, is this Sun? Oh no, Sakuya. Yeah. So this is yours, isn't it? This is mine, yeah. Wait, wait, no, no, no. There were two French brothers. Yeah, you were Yuya. Ah, right, and I was so upset I didn't choose Sakuya because uh, I didn't get to use my French accent as much. <laughs> oh, Sakuya, listen, they've appeared! Uh, the white demons stand poised to shatter the science of that most holy knight. Also, why do you sound like uh, Kazuaki-san? <laughs> He's still not going to get to talk. You, you can't just go around giving things nicknames like a certain someone next door, Robin. I don't know what he's referring to there. I have no idea. Christmas trees are being stolen all around town, Sakia. Maybe you've already heard? Ah, you must be referring to that drivel the local rag devoted the entire page to. Disgusting. Is there not more important news to be run now of all seasons? How telling is it how, how telling it is that so much attention is devoted to such foolishness. You don't like Christmas, Sakuya? What? From where do you think I hail, plebeian? France, right? Ah oui oui <laughs> Oh, of course. Christmas probably means a lot more to you than to us Japanese people. Whoa, racist? The council room is already decorated with a most fabulous tree. Uh, Le Bell overlooks nothing. I've even deigned to place it near the window so that the masses may gaze up at it in awe and wonder. Be grateful. He who does not celebrate Christmas is no true bird. That is the importance Christmas holds for us. In other words, Sakuya gets extra jolly this time of year. Ooh, extra jolly. Extra jolly. Better take notes! Trees are being stolen from in front of shops and on the sidewalk and other easily visible places. So you should probably be careful too, Sakya. Don't let it get stolen. <laughs> Do not place me on the same level as you Orientals with your infantile understanding of private security. Did I not say I overlook nothing? I know not who this villain may be. But he shall step not one centimeter within my territory. The council room's security is flawless, I tell you. Flawless! Sakaya. We call that sort of line a flag here in Japan. What? <laughs> uh, like, sort of like a foreshadow, maybe? I don't know. Oh, I see. Yes, okay. Let's start our investigation by asking people around town, Ryota! Oh my god, they're going to be detectives. Detective hateful boyfriend. Huh. Good idea. Let us know if you hear anything new or get robbed, Sakuya! <laughs> How many times must I tell you? My tree will not be stolen. Guess what? It's already gone! Shit! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Upon leaving the building, Ryota and I are greeted by the sight of Oko-san prancing about on the track. Oh, fuck. <laughs> prancing or... Maybe skipping? I'm I'm not sure. At any rate, he appears to be in pointlessly high spirits. That's perfect. Uh, you're in a good mood today, son. Did something good happen? It's perfect. What? Another Christmas fiend? Oh my god, all these birds are going bird shit crazy over this shit. <laughs> Christmas that wakes the ancestral jollity inside a dove's heart. Cool, cool, everything is falling on Christmas, because it is excited! Holy shit. And everything smells like delicious food, because is very excited. Western pastry shops always look so tempting this time of year, and your voice really kills me, oko san <laughs> Apparently. You spend a lot of time in department stores, right, son? Have you heard anything about the Christmas thieves? Ooh, the villains have to steal Okusan's delicious grub! The villains have to steal pretty Christmas trees! Christmas trees? Yes, Okusan knows about them! The trees in Okusan's favorite hut, so I'm just eagle to Barbara's door at this bit! 
High Society Seagull Department Store? Do you know where that is, Ryota? No fucking idea. Oh, no, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I worked the samples at the samples table there. I'll show you the way. Cool, I'm running away! <laughs> Here we come, High Society Seagull Department Store. Here yeah, we're coming! Holiday oh, look at that star. bird! That's a lovely bird. <laughs> ah, lovely bird. Did we get to choose whether we used human portraits or not? No. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it's in options or something. I don't think it is. This this is the way it should be played anyway. Yeah, really. Hmm. Department stores always feel a little unrealistic. A little decadent, maybe. If only I knew what that word meant. <laughs> Makes it so hard to go in. Especially since I think, oh, what a decadent place. Wait, is that the right word to use? I don't know what decadent means. Oh, shit. Well, you don't know what decadent means. Yeah. It's like... Overly extravagant. Ah, like me! Except without the overly part. Sure. They're okay, really. Just don't think about that and you'll be fine. He read my mind? More importantly, we need to ask a clerk about the thefts. Batman Bird is psychic. <laughs> right, right, yeah, of course. Um, excuse me! <laughs> uh... Should I, should I try and do, like, a posh lady voice for it? Yes. Yes, do that. Yes? May I help you? <laughs> <laughs> um, do you know where you are, young lady? <laughs> um, this is the High Society Seagull Department Store, right? Yes, that is correct. The High Society Seagull Department Store. Say it once more, with feeling... The High Society Seagull Department Store! Holy shit, too much feeling! Whoa! Good. This store is of High Society, by High Society, and for High Society. It is no place for obviously low society humans. Please leave. Holy shit. I object! <laughs> this is blatant speciesism! I hope you're ready to swallow your words or defend them with steels, cretin. Draw, man, draw, before I stick you like a rotisserie chicken. Holy <laughs> shit. Wow, Robin is pretty weird. <laughs> Calm down, Robin. Getting into a fight here won't do us any good. Please don't act like San. And just what Oko-san... Does he do? What does Okasan have? What? Nice. What? And just what does Okasan have that <laughs> makes him so much more high society than me? Huh? God, that sentence was a disaster. That was awful. <laughs> Please, we, we just want to ask you a question. We'll leave right away. Did the Christmas thieves really break into this store? They did not break into the store, no. They were not allowed in. However... As you know, the store faces onto the street. The three Christmas trees we had arranged outside were stolen! I love that voice. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Trees placed outside? Just like a Torimi cafe. Yeah. Looks like they really are aiming for easy targets first. They seem to be quite crafty. I think this might get difficult, Ryota. Ah, I can feel the thrill of the chase! My hunter-gatherer blood boils! I can feel the feel the thrill of the cheese. Right on time! <laughs> <laughs> I knew it was a good idea to ask you along. The stolen trees were of little value. We have already sent away for new ones. Dad, do you think you could wait a little before setting them up? The thieves might come back. True, but Christmas is almost here. If not now, when would we put them out? Christmas trees are just so much rubbish once it's the 26th. Watch your whore mouth! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're not rubbish. You can use them every year. Um, uh, were, were there any witnesses? The trees were in a blind spot between security cameras, so, alas, we have nothing. 
too busy staring down your own asses to look out the window, were you? Shut the fuck up! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I hope I never see you here again, young lady. (laughs) (laughs) Well, that was a disappointment. (laughs) Not for me. (laughs) All we found out is that the thieves aim for trees placed in vulnerable spots outside. Maybe we should leave. Whoa. Oh. Choices, mate. Choices. Shit. Um, furniture section. Okay. I thought we were told to leave. Oh, look at this bed. Wow, what a bed! I'm not sure this would even fit inside my house, seeing as it's a cave on the beach. Uh, is this like a bed for birds? I don't know. Why does it look like the same size as a a, a human bed? Uh, just what kind of mansion does the high society live in? <laughs> There are humidifiers, hot water bottles, and other thermal friv- frivolities. Frivolities. Frivolities are lined up nearby. Winter goods are awfully fancy. Maybe I should indulge in something. A bonfire alone just doesn't say decadent. <laughs> <laughs> you're not decadent, you're homeless. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a cave. You live in a cave, and to stay warm you light a little fire outside. It's a bonfire. <laughs> Bonfires are huge. <laughs> It's a bonfire to a bird. <laughs> True. Hey, Robin. Look over there. Mm. Mm. A disturbingly familiar quail is fast asleep on a display bed. Oh god, who could that be? I don't remember any quails. Maybe Shu? Oh no, it must be Nanaki. Sir, you can't just crash in a department store. Kazuaki, sorry. You're a grown-up now. You need to take care of yourself. Oh god, hopefully I can still remember his voice. Oh! Oh, if it isn't Joanne and Kawara. What is it? Did you want to talk about career plans? Uh, are you, are you fully awake, sir? We're not at school. Oh? Good heavens, so we aren't. <laughs> uh, you, you might have been here until closing time if we hadn't happened by. I would have bloody liked that. <laughs> oh, yes. It's been so cold recently, I was thinking maybe I should buy a new bed. It does get very chilly after dark. Make sure not to catch cold, you two. Mr. Nanaki crawls out of the bed and wobbles off towards a table covered in wool blankets of various dimensions. What a weirdo. Blankets. Oh, too bad you never had blankets as a kid because your mom's dead. Wow. I bet my Casio Mini he'll fall asleep on top of those, too. You're on. (laughs) There's nothing more to find here. Let's look somewhere else. All right, where to next? The thefts have gotten into the news. If we ask around, we should find some eyewitnesses. Sounds good. Oh, there's more crashing. Ah. What? Huh? Some glass object splinters with a monumental crash behind us as we make for the exit. I turn around and... Do you think Kazuaki's been... ganked? <laughs> Could be. What oh! the fuck? <laughs> oh, they're animated! <laughs> uh, um... <laughs> we'll have to... Oh god, what kind of voice? We, we should do them both at the same time. Because <laughs> there's two of them. <laughs> Alright. Um... um. What kind of voices would they have? Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! <laughs> what is that? I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know if I can do that. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! <laughs> okay, what is it? Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! <laughs> <laughs> I laugh too much. <laughs> Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! It's <laughs> <laughs> pretty close, I guess. Yeah, fuck it. They'll, they'll be a bit different. That's fine. Okay. Okay. That's this this fucking hell. <laughs> what the fuck are those? They look like eggs. <laughs> a little like doves, but not really. 
Are they... Maybe they are doves. In any case, a pair of bizarre white creatures are bludgeoning themselves <laughs> against a number of glass Christmas trees and reindeer. <laughs> oh my god. What are those? What are those? <laughs> <laughs> I was hoping you'd do that. What are those? <laughs> are, they, are they doves? Um, I'm not sure. I've never seen anything like them. Merry Christmas! <laughs> Merry Christmas! <laughs> <laughs> the creature's falling through the Christmas display like fussy wrecking balls, leaving behind nothing but broken glass and lost profits. <laughs> <laughs> there! The white children! Whoa, 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 this is 2015, okay? <laughs> Oh dear god, that's no good. I don't even know what the fuck that was. I think he turned into Scottish at the end, didn't he? You too! <laughs> Perfect. Where are your parents? In every visual novel, there has to be one. <laughs> Merry Christmas! In any case, I'll have to take you to the employees' lounge. <laughs> High society does have rules. Christmas? The creatures trailed dejectedly after the security guard. What are those? <laughs> I can't believe people let their kids run loose like that. I'd love to see the parents' faces when they get billed. I read that as killed. <laughs> <laughs> I guess Christmas gets everyone pretty excited. Sort of like demons which rampage during the full moon. Yeah, just like yeah, that. Exactly like that. Why not? <laughs> Riordan and I spent some time asking around town, but no one had ever caught sight of the thieves. Apparently trees just aren't being stolen from outside, but from inside houses as well. Ooh. If only we knew what the culprits looked like. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! <laughs> <laughs> if only we knew what they they sounded like as well. <laughs> huh. Oh, look at those lovely birds. Lovely pigeons. Pigeons. Yeah, darn tune. It's much not. <laughs> <laughs> I thought we found a clue. <laughs> How did you fuck that I up? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs>